children we are on the second lesson of class 4 science that is the teeth let us see the key topics sets of teeth different kinds of teeth structure of a tooth care of teeth and gums good food habits for healthy teeth and gums let us begin the lesson teeth are present in the upper and lower jaws of the mouth teeth helps a person use their mouth to eat speak smile and give shape to their face so teeth are of vital importance and we can and we should take care of them coming to the first part that is a sets of teeth there are two sets of teeth one is the milk teeth or temporary teeth or we can say another set is permanent teeth babies are born without teeth the teeth starts appearing when the baby is around 6 months old a 3 year old child has 20 teeth please underline first set of teeth in a child is called milk teeth or temporary teeth coming to info buzz please take it out giraffes have only bottom teeth then coming to the diagram of a temporary teeth you can see upper jaw lower jaw this is central incisor this is lateral incisor canine first molar second molar coming to the lower jaw second molar this is first molar printing error is there please cut it and write first molar then this is canine this is lateral incisor this is central incisor after a child's milk teeth have fallen fallen out which occurs between 6 and 12 years of age the adult teeth begin to erupt by the age of 20 a new set of teeth is developed called the permanent teeth please underline by the age of 20 a new set of teeth developed called permanent teeth 32 teeth are there 16 in each jaw you can see the diagram over here this is central incisor this is lateral incisor then canine then first premolar second premolar first molar second molar third molar then to the lower jaw third molar second molar first then second premolar first premolar canine lateral incisor then central incisor then coming to different kinds of teeth four types of teeth are there incisor canine premolar and molar let us see its function beginning with incisor helps to cut and bite the food four in each jaw are there please underline then coming to canine canine are the sharpest teeth used for tearing it is two in each jaw coming to the premolar they are broad and flat teeth basically it used for crushing they are four premolar in each jaw then coming to the molar molar are the grinding teeth premolars are followed by another set of broad and flat teeth called molars a young child has four molars molars in each jaw while an adult has six of them in each jaw please see the picture you can see the diagram over here incisor canine premolar and molar coming to the table this table is important in the upper jaw number of incisor is the 4 in the lower jaw 4 so total is 8 canine in the upper jaw 2 lower jaw 2 total number is 4 premolar in the upper jaw 4 lower jaw 4 total number is 8 coming to molar now on the upper jaw 6 lower jaw 6 so total is 12 so total 32 number of permanent teeths are there coming to the structure of a tooth you can see the diagram over here the structure a tooth is made up of different parts some parts are soft while some are hard when you smile the part of your tooth that we can see is called the crown this part is called the crown which is present inside the gum in called the root you can underline the crown is the visible part of a tooth and the part of the tooth which is present inside the gum is called the root all the dark colored word please underline it then next is the enamel the hard outer layer of the crown it is the hardest substance in the body 
protects the inner portion of the tooth. You can see here, this is enamel. Please underline the shiny white part that we see is called the enamel and it is the hardest substance in the human body. Then comes the dentine. Below the enamel lies the dentine. It is also very hard in nature. It is also very hard in nature. This portion is the dentine. Then coming to infobus, the crocodile bird is also known as plover bird. You can write it. Flies into the open mouth of a crocodile and cleans the crocodile teeth. It is important. Please stick it out. Then coming to the next part, inside the dentine is the pulp. What is the function of it? It is soft and has blood vessels and nerves in it. The pulp extends from the crown to the top of the root. Or we can say the root holds the tooth in the jaw and makes sure that the tooth, tooth stays in place. The next portion we will give in the next video.